and this blog is about sharing what my friends and I do to make our busy lives a little more green. I'm here with John Horsing, and uh, we were talking the other day about the what did you do today to help the environment. You made a really great comment. It wasn't something you did today, no. about three years ago. Yeah, a number of years ago with my kids. You know, my wife insisted on the idea of using cloth diapers as a what appealed to me was the financial savings, about $1,500 a year you're not throwing away with every dirty diaper. Um, and she was looking at the environmental standpoint, which is an excellent case, and the reality of it was is I didn't want to change poopy diapers. And so the, the ones that were pee weren't so bad, and we figured out the, our children were on kind of regular schedule after a while, and so you run the cloth diapers up until the time before they're going to poop, and we use one disposable day for the uh, poopy diaper, and you didn't have to deal with that in the cloth, and you can go back to just the urine-filled ones for the rest of the time. So it was a way to not have to deal with the mess and still get an uh, accomplishment of uh, green savings and a financial savings as well. It was really a, a worthwhile experience. That is an awesome idea. Um, it really it got me thinking. I mean, I got eight kids. Yeah. And I, I just always do disposable stuff. Yeah. Oh, you know, who but, wants to deal with them? Man, if you got a kid that's regular like that, that is a great way. Best of both worlds. Yep. You get the savings, but you don't have the yuck. Right. I, that was great, John. Thanks. Thanks for being on Real Green World. Yeah. Thanks for doing it. So ask yourself. What can I do to be a little more green today? And subscribe now to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.